Hi, my name is Thomas Kim. Uh, today, I'm going to explain how to use Chrome, Chrome Embedded Framework, or it is called a Ceph, Ceph with Visual, Visual C Sharp. And at the end of this session, we, we will have a web browser like this. We will have a web browser like this. And I am using Ceph, Chrome Embedded Framework. I am using Chrome Embedded Framework. At the end of this session, we will have something like this web browser. In the Visual Studio 2015, go to File menu, New Project. In the New Project dialog box, Click Install Template C Sharp window, then select Windows Form Application. In the Solution Name field, Set Browser Solution. In the Name field, Set Browser. Then click OK. In this state, uh, press F5, F5 function key to try it. Okay, it is running properly. Close it. Then we are going to change it into X60, uh, X uh, Windows 80, 86, 86 platform. Right click here, then properties, then here configuration, configuration here, and select configuration manager here, new, then x86, okay, okay, close. Then OK. This is OK button. Now click uh, press F5 again. You have to notice this X86. It is running properly. Close it. Now go to Tool menu. Then do get Package Manager. Package Manager Console. OK. Here. Type in install package self re this tree x86 press enter okay successfully installed and we install once again like this I I press the arrow keys of arrow keys 64 then hit enter again okay then I need to install one I have to install one two more packages install package save sharp come on then hit enter Okay, successfully installed. Now install once again. It package. Now self sharp win poems. Hit enter again. Okay, successfully installed. We have we installed Packages like this. This is the first package we installed, the second, third, and the fourth. We installed the four packages and then go to select reference, right click, add a reference, and select browse, browse, then move to package folder. 
this is the solution we installed and this is installed here uh, common sharp C sharp Cef sharp x86 select two two DLRs chef sharp core DLR chef sharp dot DLR okay then browse once again now move up no not package win form here chef now click this one so we have to click OK OK then we can find the chef uh, chef reference references are added here save save all click it here right click view code and here we'll type in some text using using chef chef then using once again chef chef win forms and in in the form body we will type in I made it in preview in, in I typed it this before prepared it already and another text we need some more text like this these are added I just copy and paste and copy and paste now save now field save and build F5 okay so we created a uh, we used Ceph, Ceph, Chrome embedded uh, framework. We are using that and stop it. So so far we are using the uh, 86 Windows platform, and we want to change it to uh, 64 Windows. So right click here again, properties, here again, configuration manager new and we have to select it x86 then ok then close then ok now this is 86 86 as uh, 60 64 bit version now we learn f5 again ok we have some error messages we are going to fix this now close this and shift F5 shift F5 to stop debugging then save it and close solution we have to close all solution like this I will make it smaller then open I open the uh, Windows Explorer and this is the project we created I am moving here chef chef browser then this is project uh, project C sharp project right click open uh, I can use edit with not not fed plus if you do not have this then select like this not fed not fed not fed okay okay I open not fed and scroll down scroll down to the end here and uh, what we have to change it is here 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 let me see we have to fix this okay I will make a smaller font uh, okay here reference include section we have 3x86 86 86 and 86 we have to change it fix it like this and remove it then it, it should be 
platform platform copy it and we replace it to replace then here again replace I replaced and save it so the place you have to change is something reference include okay reference include reference include you have to find the section reference include sh shift form win forms like this and you have to replace X three times three times now save it close it comes back to here open the solution again now x this is 64 bit debugging mode now press f5 okay it is working it is working properly and if i move if i browsing news you can see it is working properly okay so this is in 64 bit 64 bit application and if i change it like this 86 uh, 86 32 bit platform and f5 again okay it is working for this is debugging mode I, I will use release then in this case i have to go press control f5 debug uh, release mode it is working release mode then uh, six, 64 platform cpu platform control f5 again okay it's working perfectly so this way we built we used a uh, chrome web browser chrome embedded framework we we made a, a simple web browser thank you for watching